Do you heard it still don't look right after using Topaz to upscale them? Well, don't worry, because today we'll show you step by step everything you need to know on how to use Topaz to boost your quality to the top. So once you've exported the clip that you want to upscale in After Effects, you can go ahead and import it into Topaz. Also make sure to upscale the clip before adding a coloring, shakes or any other effects. This is going to improve your overall quality. So once we've imported our scene into Topaz, make sure to go ahead and for the AI model scroll all the way down and choose the one at the very bottom. So once we've selected the right AI model, we're going to go ahead and select the right parameters. Most of the parameters are pretty self-explanatory, but if you have any questions, what each and every parameter does to your scene, you can go ahead and click on this question mark and it's going to show you a brief explanation on what it does. So to start we're going to put the reverb compression from 27 down to 20, put recover details up to 35, also we're going to put the sharpen to 35, now we're going to reduce our noise by 30, we're going to put this setting up to 25 and the last one also up to 35. The best settings for every edit are also going to be dependent on what clips you use, so don't be afraid and play around with the values a bit to make it fit your likings. Once we've done all that we can scroll down and we're just gonna leave all the settings how they are and once you made sure everything is in the right place you can go ahead and start processing your edit also be aware that the exporting on topaz can take a while depending on how long your clip is and how fast your computer works so don't be afraid if the processing might take a while so once your scenes finished processing you can go ahead and edit into after effects so now once you import your clip into after effects just make sure to press s on your keyboard and adjust it to your composition settings if you had the scale at 200 you're just gonna set the value to 50 so it fits your frame and now the last and most important part is going to be adding a good color correction. As you can see, a high quality color correction can increase your quality immensely. Adding a good color correction can give you far better results than any Topaz could ever do. So for every editor, it's a necessity to have a good color correction. Now don't be worried because I'm having a huge sale on my shop right now so you can get my exact coloring that I use to make my edits look the best for the cheapest price ever. Make sure to not miss out on your opportunity to become the best quality ever in the first link in the description. Once you've added your new color correction, you can now go ahead and export your edit. If you're unsure about what render settings to use make sure to check out my full guide on how to render edits in after effects if you liked this video make sure to leave a like and subscribe to support my work also let me know in the comments what tutorial you want to see next as i said don't forget about the huge opportunity in my shop right now also make sure to check out my discord i'm on there 24 7 you can just ask me questions or get in touch with me that's it thank you for watching and see you next time